Retirement used to be pretty basic. You work for the same company for many years until a certain age, and then you get that golden watch and a pension. Pretty good, right? Yeah, it was nice. Does not happen that way anymore. No. Retirement comes at many different ages in many different circumstances, and you're lucky to get the watch, let alone the pension. There is a new book called Repurposed, the untold story of retirement in America. Author Ben Tatius has advice for people to help them retire into a new purpose in life after leaving the workforce. And the author joins us now on Mid Morning. Ben, good morning. Yeah, good morning, guys. So you are a finance guy, mm -hmm. and we talk a lot on the show about finances, especially when it comes to retirement, but you say that's not the purpose of this book. It's not to focus on money in retirement. Yeah, it's really not. Um, you know, this book started uh, five, six years ago, met with a guy that was 62, hoping to retire at 65. So we're running through some preliminary numbers for him and find out that uh, he can retire now, okay? That sounds great. And the financial part was there. But what we found when he came in later to see us is he had changed and mm. he wasn't the same man. Mm. Yeah, just being retired and not having a purpose. Mm -hmm. yeah. You are the CEO of Tatius Financial Group mm -hmm. in Wilmer. Uh, your firm is retirement planning. So what made you say, you know what, I'm, I, I should put this down. I should write a book. Uh, really, it was this guy's story. That story. This gym yeah. that started it all. And uh, we knew there ha we had to do more in our business. Mm -hmm. We had to help prepare people for coming into retirement versus just retiring from something. We wanted to retire to something. So you have part of your job giving advice mm -hmm. and you say you've given some bad advice before just once or yeah. once once one, one time so yeah, what well, was the worst that one time that was not not yeah, great advice yeah the, the time and again it comes back to that story yeah. um, where we had given this guy Jim this advice to retire at 62 mm -hmm. okay and we didn't give him time really to wait and kind of process mm -hmm. through the non-financial yeah. issues that, that people You find. looked at the numbers and said you can retire. Yeah. yeah, exactly, and forgot about the person behind the so numbers. So what is the balance you're looking at that you recommend people think about at least when it comes time to retiring? Well, we, we want to find, we want to help our, our people, our clients find mm -hmm. purpose in retirement, right? We want them to balance rest, okay, and really the only way to true rest and fulfillment is through serving others. Mm. So is that something that you t sit down and talk about or some of the ways that they can actually do that? Do you recommend volunteer work or joining a board? What Ab are some of the things that you absolutely. go over? Absolutely, and it can be something major, mm -hmm. like you know, um, starting up uh, nonprofits, working with nonprofits, or be something minor, just making sure that we have a purpose, a cause greater than ourselves as we move into retirement. A lot of us, when we're working, don't think about this. We're just focused on getting up, getting to work, getting ahead, making money. Mm -hmm. How you talk about practicing, really mm -hmm. practicing retirement. Yeah. What does that mean? Well, it's we've found that the, the group of people that retires better than anyone else are teachers. Hmm. And you really? think about their lives o over their, their summers off, they get a chance to kind of become what we call talent chameleons, where they'll come into different uh. work and different things during the summers, and they've, they've always practiced taking these months off, and they do it really well. That's really cool. That's awesome. Great stuff, Ben. Yeah. Where can Thanks. people find the book? Uh, you can go to our website, retirerepurposed.com. Great. Perfect. Very good. Ben, thank you.